I've missed my Leos. I love my Leos. Welcome. My name is Serafina Safi and I present Enchanted Mirror Tarot. So this is from May. Uh, I'm saying it's May 2019 right now, but it could be any time in May. And we start out with the two of pentacles in reverse. So there could have been a relationship that just ended or a job that just ended. Something just ended. You dropped the ball on something. There's a lot of conflict here. It could have been with an air sign or an earth sign. I have the two of pentacles twice here. There's a lot of anxiety. There's communication here. And it's good communication, but you're just very anxious about this. And I see that you're juggling. You're juggling different options. There is something that ended. It just, you dropped the ball. And there's a lot of anxiety and stress and sleepless nights over it. And there's communication here, there's, um, but it's going very slow. There's this very slow moving energy here and it's going towards juggling. You're juggling too much. You have your, and I see that you have options. You're at a crossroads. You have two ways that you can go. If you go this way, we have something very traditional um, but there's like ill health or poverty here, but they have each other. You have family. If you go this, this way, it's very traditional. You have family, but it's not a happy family. There's a lot of conflict here, a lot of stress, but you have each other and it's very traditional. If you, if you take this road, if you take that road, if you go on the other crossroad, I see you losing money and starting a new journey. You lose money and you start a new journey. So your two options at this crossroads, yeah, if you choose this side, there's gonna be poverty in the beginning and something very traditional and you have somebody to lean on and it ends with massive financial abundance and the Midas touch and very, very good. If you take this, it starts out like you're poor, but then you end up very financially abundant if you take this choice. If you take that choice, you lose a lot of money. There's a completion here. You're stuck, you're stagnant, There's, you're sinking. And then you end up a clear, effective communicator, but you don't end the cycle, you get stuck in the past. So if you're in between two options, one option, you're gonna start out poor, but you end up very financially abundant. So you're going to be investing a lot into it. And it's very traditional, it's the traditional path. So if you have a, a path that's non-traditional versus traditional, you wanna go down the traditional route and that's the way to go. If you go towards the non-traditional route, you lose a lot of money, you get stuck, you're sinking. There's good communication here, but you get stuck in the past. If you go toward to the traditional route, so that's what you wanna do. You're at a crossroads. Well, that was only four minutes. I felt like I was talking for a half hour. Yeah, I see you working really hard. You work really hard here. But that's the best way to do it. It's slow, it's steady, it's methodical, it's planned out, it's traditional, and it ends in absolute abundance, happiness, prosperity. And then over here, it's non-traditional and it's just so don't don't in may don't do anything that goes against the grid that's 
unique or you don't want to do that because it'll just end in absolute failure and disaster. You want to stay traditional. It, it may not seem like it, you have a lot of gain in the beginning because it has to work up that way. It's a very hard working, slow moving, slow moving energy. But it ends in absolute abundance and everything you touch turns to gold. Thank you, Leo. Have a wonderful day.